What is up everyone? Welcome into this new video. In today's tutorial, let's take a look how you can fulfill your orders into Shopify using your CJ dropshipping. So this CJ dropshipping is a great starter if you're just getting started with the dropshipping business in the e-commerce. So it's really, really easy to work in here. All right, so the first thing we need to do, of course, in order to start working in here, of course, in Shopify is to have an account. I'm going to leave you guys a link down below in the description so you can get started totally for free. And you might be getting a few rewards just by signing up. So with that being said, what I just need to do, I need to go into the dashboard of my Shopify. You're going to be seeing something like that. You don't have to be worrying about how to create your online store, the point of sale. You don't have to be worrying about any of that. What we have to do first is to import products from the CJ dropshipping into Shopify and then we can connect both of them so the order can be fulfillment between both uh, places, the online store that you have in there and your account that you have in the CJ dropshipping. So let's jump right into it. Let's do this in a very easy and really fastest way. So the first thing I want to do here is to go into apps. Here into apps, I want to look for recommended apps. So you might be seeing here that appears the CJ dropshipping. If you don't see this available in here, you want to go into Shopify App Store, download it, and then you can make the installation as we're going to be doing that right now. So here into grant access, here to install application. And here we are now inside the CJ dropshipping. So what you want to do is to create a new CJ account and create an account it's really easy you just have to fill your email you have to fill all of that so i'm going to just close this for a second like this hit into close all and just like that here appears i'm going to just never remind me again i what should i do next and hit into the x button just like that we do have the authorization success so that's the reason why we added the cj dropshipping inside this store of shopify so we don't have to do the grant integration, we just skipped a few steps so we can do this a little bit more faster. So what I want to do is to click into the logo of CK Dropshipping and look for the item that I want to sell. So I want to look for, let's say for example, I can just stick around with this one, this silicone grip uh, device finger exercise and hit into list. So what's going to happen here is going to be sending me into the edit section of the edit my item. What you want to do is to choose your store. You want to ship from product title, hit into collection, the vendor is ours, hit into recommended list in price, so we can start to sell and hit into list now. Now speaking about the product type, you want to add new, let's say for example this is uh, for hands, hit into confirmed and hit into list now. Now uh, it's really easy just to list our project, our products into our store. So. Uh, what you want to do is to make sure that your uh, products has been listed successfully. I'm going to head back into Shopify and here I want to go into products and here into products I must see that my item has been now added successfully. So as you can see here it is, here's the inventory, the type, the vendor and the status. So it's really really easy to do that, right? So now what I do want to do is to add a new section. I want to go into my account in here and then what I want to do is to connect my item from CJ dropshipping into Shopify so I can make the order fulfillment automatically. So here I want to go back into the product that I just selected, I'm going to hit connect and then what we want to do is to find our store which is actually this one. I want to copy and paste the exact name that appears into my product. It's in here and I want to paste that into the SKU number and hit into search. So hit into synced and hit into confirmed. Product in store, please wait a moment. So we just have to wait a couple of seconds here. The sync has now been successful. So what I do want to do now is to go into my connection to see if my item has been now added successfully. So I don't have to do absolutely anything after the order fulfillment because that's the reason why this one has been automatically added. So if you go into my CJ and you get into connection, here is your item. Here is the item from my store and this is the item 
from the CJ packaging ordinary. So when someone makes a payment, when someone buys inside my store, inside my products, it's going to be appearing in here the order. And automatically, this order is going to be appearing into my CJ dropshipping account. Here, as you can see, this is my price. And this is the price that the uh, warehouse have available to sell this item. So that's how we can connect our two same products. So before I leave, guys, I must tell you three things. Now, uh, reason number one, uh, just in case this one does not work, so you have to use exactly the same item. If I connect from one place into another one, this should be added automatically. So as you can see here, it's exactly the same item, the same title, the same product, the same ID. Everything has to be just as it is into CJ Dropshipping. If you want to edit, for example, here, the name of your product, you can do that in here. But this product has to be changed it into your CJ, into, into your orders, into your products. So where it says listed, you want to change the name that appears into your products from Shopify. And lastly, what you have to take in mind is that if you want to get started here into Shopify, of course, you need to have enabled the shipping method and the payment method already enabled. And for doing that, you want to go into settings. Here in settings, choose the payment. And here in the payment, what you want to do is to choose the option that says choose a provider. Here in to choose a provider, what I want to do is to look for payment methods that accept what you want to accept. For example, Apple Pay, I want to add a MasterCard and a Visa and a PayPal. So here are all the options that are available into my specific country. For example, I do have Mercado Pago. Now, this is a very great way to uh, earn the money because here, this is the one that is like the best option for Latin America uh, countries but you want to choose the option that best fits for you. In my case, I just need to sign in into this account, into my account for Mercado Pago, and then I just need to enable all of this option, Visa, MasterCard, American Express, PayPal, and this ticket option. If you go into the enable the test mode, we can just simulate a successful or a failed transaction. So uh, that's the reason why you want to activate that. So with that being said, I can go back here, I can go into leave my page, and I can see if my store is now active. But lastly, I'm gonna go into my online store and see if this one is active already. Hit into the three dots and here into preview. I want to see if everything is okay. So uh, there you have it guys, it wasn't that hard. As you can see, here is my featured products. When someone makes a sale inside my Shopify account, it's gonna be right away added into the orders of the CJ Trump shipping. And the best part is that when someone makes a refund, wants a refund, uh, wants to change an item from another one, you don't have to do absolutely anything. Uh, you just need to hit back into the CJ Trump shipping, go into your orders, go into the orders fulfillment, and here it must be appearing your orders, depending on what does the customer wants to solve. Here's gonna be appearing all the options for us. It's really, really simple. Just in case you have any question, you can always go into the customer support for the CJ Drop Shipping, and those guys are gonna be helping us right away in no time. So thank you so much for watching the video, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel if you do want to see more great tools about the CJ Drop Shipping. Thank you so much for watching the video, guys. Good luck with your store and I'll see you on the next video.